Okay, here we are at 7313 Winnipeg Drive. It's a nice neighborhood. That's Carr Middle School right over there across the way, the sports fields. Here we are on the interior coming into the foyer. It's hardwood floors. Closet right as you come in, a large double door closet. Plenty of storage area for shoes and jackets. Come back through the hall here. It's a half bath here on the right. Come back into the just renovated kitchen with the granite countertops. All new stainless appliance suite. All brand new range. And there's a high performance hood made in Asia, which is a very high volume. Ducks outside. Super strong. It's designed to get all the, you know, if you stir fry or whatever, anything with all. A lot of grease, it will get it right out of the house instead of putting it on the ceiling in the kitchen. Screen the countertops. The island here. Come back. Brand new pergo floors in here. Come back in here. Here's the sliding doors off the eating area going out to the patio. You just see the brick patio there. Actually, it's a paver stone patio with a brick pattern. Deck chairs. It's a beautiful neighborhood. Really nice yards. So come back here. There's a straight back into the family room, and then there's a den off of there. See the true wood burning fireplace. Ceiling fan, vaulted ceiling. Lots of windows back through here. Here's a, a den. Great place for the kids to study or have a home office. Looking back towards the kitchen from the family room. To our left is a hallway leading out to the garage. It's a closet right here as you come in and nice laundry room and enough space here with the sink for muddy boots snowy boots here in the winter time we'll go back through the kitchen here go into the dining room into the living room here and we'll go up the stairs to our right or straight ahead and to the right are the three off bedrooms the, and then here to the left is the master it's a large vaulted ceiling Large windows, south facing windows here. And you can see the sports fields of Carr Middle School. And you can just make out part of the building over there behind those houses is Carr Middle School. It's a large closet back here. Walk in, turn, even more space back in here. You can make that out. It's a good sized closet. Back. There's a ledge or soffit up there above where the master bath is, but it's sealed off so you don't have any humidity from the bathroom come in. Really nice master bathroom. It's a nice whirlpool tub. It's 
separate shower. Water closet or toilet. And extra tall vanity. You can see that the vaulted ceilings continue through here. But it's sealed off. That's where we saw that ledge where you could put plants or whatever. Okay. Go back out. Down the hallway here. Here's the first bedroom. Probably the smallest of the three. The hall bath. On down the hallway here. Closet straight ahead. To the left, one of the bedrooms. It's got the second bedroom. Here to the right is the largest of the bedrooms other than the master. It's a good size room. A nice size closet as well. Okay, now we're in the basement of the Winnipeg Drive house. You can see that it has two hot water tanks, which is nice for giving plenty of hot water supply for the large master whirlpool tub. There's the furnace. This is a full basement. There is no crawl space. You can see there's plenty of room for whatever storage, exercise equipment. Pan around here. You can see the rough end over there for the uh, for a future restroom of a future toilet. And back here they have a ping pong table set up. Okay, I found that light switch <laughs> for the storage area. As you can see, there's just plenty of storage back here, sealed off from the rest of the basement, which is nice. The kids won't be into it. Fire for the furnace system. The tanks. 